You can probably see from the footage that we've got ourselves a new van. We've got a Burstner. Uh, absolutely fabulous van. It's not really so much about the van today. It's more about the wheels that are going to be going on it. So we're taking a trip down to Reading. We stopped off last night uh, at a little pub stop, which was great. Uh, but we're going to be doing uh, a swapping of the wheels and the tyres. We're going for some off-road ones ready for our NC500 trip in about two or three weeks time. So we'll see you at Rogue Alloys. our new baby. These are the original wheels so we'll keep those for summer because they're a diamond cut alloy and we don't want all the salt and dirt and everything to damage the lacquer so we're going for something that can take um, you know take the weather conditions through the winter. But yeah that's our Burst 690G Harmony line we got just a couple of months ago we haven't um, really done a review on this one yet because we prefer to have a van you know at least five or six months just so that we know all the little bits and pieces about the van before we share it with you guys but there she is we absolutely love it right so chris is the guy that we've been dealing with let's go and see what he's got to say well we're buying two sets of alloys for our work vans and also a set for the moho so we've got ms W48 with uh, BF Goodridge all terrain tyres on to go on this, and that's for our well, basically for our little trip up to the NC500 next month. We'll see how that goes. I'm sure, you don't mind being on YouTube? Oh, I don't mind. <laughs> that would be nice. I'm gonna be famous. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name? Harvey. 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 Yeah. I'm Nathan. Nathan, that's Nathan. Rebecca inside, yeah. yeah. So what's that, Chris? That is Europe's first M16 by 1.5 black hole. So am I the first one to have that? Yeah. There you go. Amazing, thank you. You're welcome. Do you enjoy the work? Yeah. You do? I did this job from uh, more than 20, 21 years. Yeah. So where were you before this then? Uh, I was in Italy. Yeah? Uh, I started my country when I was 15. Wow. I'm 37. Yeah, yeah. Always doing this job. Yeah, I like it. You miss Italy? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. It's a beautiful country, isn't it? Yeah, beautiful country. That's one of the places I'd like to take this to. Oh uh, yeah, there is a... Uh... Long drive though. We've got a bag of bolts. They're going to go back on when we put the other wheels on for the summer. We'll keep all those. About that way, first in Europe. To have these black bolts fitted. 
I didn't fancy having the caps, um, you know, little black caps over silver ones. So uh, he said we've well, got these coming out, but I had to wait for them, so glad we did. So Chris said I've got to get some soapy water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a sponge and yeah. sponge. They're, they're gonna be white. Yeah. <laughs> he <laughs> says you've sent some of these out to customers before and they said I wanted white writing, not blue. <laughs> <laughs> so it's as easy as that, is it? Yeah, as easy as that. I suppose it's worth asking the experts then, is there any sort of aftercare for tyres? You know, is there anything that you should put on them or shouldn't put on them? Leave as is. Yeah. Yeah, you can get some like nourishing gels, but I don't know if that's just a gimmick. A lot of the tyre sheen that they use at public car washes can deteriorate the side of the dry them out. Yeah. So yeah, all those. days. Um, other than that, yeah, just quite a hardy tyre. taking these ones for the work vans. Beautiful, thank you. You've been loading me up, thank you very much. No problem, any time. You're gent, you are. I've got one more to about it. Uh, one more. I've got one more GC1. Yeah, one more. Yeah. yeah. Lovely bit of room in here though. Yeah, can we keep it to four high four, on each? Yeah. yeah, that's fine. So four on that side and then the original that's wheels on it. This one here. Thank you. Thanks buddy. Super. Thank you very much. You're it's been nice meeting you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. things we were a little bit worried might happen is um, we fitted the wheels and the new tyres and then there'd be loads of road noise but I think you can tell there is slightly more noise but not significantly what do you think Ben? I can't tell at all. No so if you know if you're worried about that um, you know trying to get all-terrain tyres for your motorhome it really hasn't made much difference to us it's quite a quiet van anyway um, but the I think it is noticeable ever so slightly, but nothing that would that would in any way put you off, you know, if you had them fitted. So yeah, if you've enjoyed the video, give us a thumbs up, please. It does help the channel. And uh, we'd love it if you'd subscribe and hit the notification button. And we'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.